sights you like to see. Well, here we go again. And for me, it's that time of the month. Yeah, that time of the month where the Corvette goes home. Long time coming for what was going to be a short project. Oh well, life goes on. Not a real bright and sunny day, but... And I didn't take too many pictures of this car, unfortunately. I kind of forgot. Got sidetracked. I'll try and insert what I do have to give you kind of a before and after. Looks good. Straight, shiny. I'm thinking back. The only thing I didn't fix something on in this car was the right front fender. Other than that, everything needed some attention. Including a lot of things I didn't count on. So, for all you Corvette people out there watching, has anybody put an LS in a C3? And if you have, a few questions. Number one, what did you use for a radiator? Number two, what did you use for an intake manifold? Number three, what did you use for a transmission? And number four, the important one, how well did it go together and how well did it work? So, this is what I always look forward to when I take on one of these projects, is seeing the taillights at the end of the driveway for the last time. And this video, other than to see the end of this thing, this car is going home on the CAA Express, which for you in the U.S. of A, is our equivalent to AAA. So I just want to show that it's all in one piece on this end, and hopefully it arrives in one piece on the other end. So, I'm not sure what's up next. Might take a little time and enjoy summer for what's left of it. So until next time, thanks for watching, and we'll catch you later.